now we have installed our uh, latest version of powershell and updated the help on the powershell console uh, as you worked in the previous video so let's get started with the powershell now so as you're a beginner you don't know anything about powershell you're working on the powershell for the first time in your life um, which means you don't know which commandlets are available which command to use to perform a specific task and how to use it the basic uh, questions that comes into our mind are what command to use and how to use that command these are the two major questions uh, everybody will be having when they start working with powershell uh, to help you get started with i'll introduce you to two very useful commandlets one is get command and the other one is get help so in this video i'm going to talk mostly about get command commandlet so get command commandlet if you read description about this command get help hyphen get command you can see how this command is useful for you so the name of the commandlet is get command synopsis of the command description of the command is gets all the commands on the powershell console as we have uh, installed latest version of powershell uh, that is 5.1 uh, if you issue the get command on the blank powershell window it will retrieve all the commandlets available in this specific version and uh, prints the result on the screen so description of the commandlet is the get command commandlet gets all the commands that are initialized on your computer including commandlets aliases functions workflows filters scripts and applications get command gets the commands from windows powershell modules and snap-ins and commands that were imported from other sessions and blah 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 so if we issue the command right now let's see what happens so it's going to show you uh, the list of commandlets available in this specific version so these are all the commands available in this specific version and uh, uh, I have a couple of additional modules also installed on me, my machine related to Microsoft Azure. So uh, when I issue the get command, it is also pulling the commandlets which are related to Azure uh, platform. So I'll show you in a minute uh, what are all those commands and basic Windows related commands are uh, very less when compared to the uh, this specific out, output if you can see here there is a module called AZ dot network which is related to Microsoft Azure networking module and uh, in the same way uh, we have Azure backup we have Azure data lake analytics so all the commands which, which show Microsoft PowerShell utility Microsoft PowerShell core those are the commands which are coming from Microsoft PowerShell installation by default now we got our commands list and let's see how many of them uh, are available in 5.1 when we install Azure modules. By issuing this specific command, you can see the count of commandlets got installed on your machine. That is get hyphen command dot count. So there are about 6,500 commandlets installed on my machine, including Azure command modules. So now we pulled out all the commands available in our machine and uh, we need to filter this list and find a specific command that uh, actually serves our purpose right so i wanted to manipulate service related settings or i wanted to look at process related information i wanted to list out files on my drive so i don't know which command to use so using get help get command we can actually figure out a way to find um, the specific command that is required for our operations so just bear with me i'll continue this thing in the next video so we can see how to filter out um, a specific command out of these 6500 commandlets to use it for our activity thank you for watching this video and please do subscribe my channel if you like the video and also click on bell icon to get notified whenever a video is available.